What do you think, what made the chemistry between you guys so great? I would say the work ethic that we had, man. There's no doubt about that. I mean, Tom led the way. He showed us the work ethic. Same with Coach Belichick. Same with the coaching staff. I mean, I got there like 10 years into the dynasty, about not eight to 10 years into it. So the work ethic was already established. But we would go out to the practice field, and it, we just wouldn't practice. We would make sure all the details and the fine points were hit. You know what I mean? Like, you can go out there, run a route, and you can be faster than everyone, but you can be covered by someone that's not as fast as you as because you're not really running the route how you're supposed to. So it's all about the details. It's all about, you know, being on the same page as well, the chemistry with each other, Tom throwing the ball, knowing where it's going to be, knowing when to turn around, him knowing when I'm going to go out on my break, when I'm going to do a little move so he knows when to throw the ball as well. So all of that happened because of the chemistry of our work ethic and staying after practice every single day and making sure we we're on the same page every single time we hit the do, field. Do you remember your first interaction with uh, Bill Belichick and Tom? Do you have a story on that? I mean, with Tom, I remember I was getting my ankles tape, taped. I was in the training room and he came up to me. He's like, what's up, Rob Gronkowski? He's like, I'm Tom Brady. And I was like, oh. I was like, yeah, I know. Hi, <laughs> hi, Tom Brady. And like, I was just starstruck at the moment, just put my hand out and shook his hand. And uh, I remember the first time I was in the huddle with him, though, his just knowledge of football is so fast and he doesn't slow down for you. If you're not up to his pay, up to his speed, it's like you got to get out of the you huddle. Catch up yeah, you got to yeah. catch up until you can get into the huddle. So he said the first play I was ever in the huddle and I was like, yo, like, it's like learning. It's like hearing a language for the first time. You're like, yo, I don't, I don't know what the heck Were you he just said. About- yeah, I was confused. I looked over at my coach. He's like over there. And I was like, oh man, I got, I got to, I got to, you know, catch up. That's for sure. Is there ever a time where Tom or Bill had to check you? Oh, like make sure, you know, just like you were, you were oh, dog fucking a little bit. Oh like, yeah, man. Is there a story with that? Yeah. They checked me a couple of times. That's for sure. I remember one time Tom Brady always wanted me to run a corner route to get outside of the defender. If he's playing like 10 yards off of me and I'm running a corner, a flag route, he's like, get outside leverage every time you break it to the flag. And like, I just wasn't capable of getting outside leverage. Like I was just too stiff sometimes, you know? too lazy i would say actually that's probably the better answer <laughs> and uh, i kept going inside because then when you go inside the guy's just going to seal you off and then you make the break and he's right there on you but i always felt like for myself i had a better chance of still like giving getting like a turbo boost and getting around the guy even if i went inside him but brady always wants the guy to go outside so i went outside again and then in the meeting practice meeting right after he's like yo I ain't going to throw you the ball no more. He's like, you just keep going outside. Like, what, what the F? I, I don't throw to anyone that goes outside on a flag. And then, like, he said it like, you know, I was a rookie. It was like, damn, it kind of hurt, you know. But <laughs> I just really noticed he was really hard on myself as well out there out in the football field uh, because he saw, you know, greatness in me, I would say. I didn't really realize, like, why he was so hard on me at first because, you know, I'm 21. I want to have fun. Like, I want to go out there, run my route. I don't really, you know, I care about some coaching points, but I never really cared like so much about the details. And then um, from there, that that from that day on, I was like, all right, like, you know, I got to show this guy up now. You know, I'm glad he yelled at me. Um, I took it the wrong way at first, but then the next day I finally realized like he's just trying to wake me up. He's trying to get me in the right position so I can be able to go out there and make a play for the team. And then from there, you know, we just hit it off halfway through my rookie year. Uh, he was hired on me a, a little bit um, more throughout my rookie year, but then it all clicked. And then we just went off from there, man. And the uh, rest is history. 